So before I start shuffling, I see that somebody wants to come in to communicate and give you everything that they have. Like all that they have to offer. <laughs> yeah, it was my kid's birthday. We had a little birthday party for them. So I was just chilling with that. And went on vacation. Get a little change of scenery type stuff. So, I feel like this person is only the way that they are because they've tried so many times and got played so many times. And it's like, instead of turning into a bad person, they continue to remain themselves. They just put a little more, like, they they put up, they, they have walls put up, but it's like... So, yeah, you think they being an asshole is just hard for them to trust because you say something that sound good and they fall for it and don't be that. But you can't get everybody that energy and this person realized that. So they got one more. They got actually it's saying that they don't have no more chances in them. So it's like for them to even try to approach you with everything you feel me all, this is all I got to offer for you what you want da, da, da. take it or leave it type stuff yeah this person has trust issues they haven't given up they just haven't found that one that'll make them want to to let down their walls Ask and you shall receive. Like this person has a good, giving, kind heart, but they don't want to be taken advantage of. Yeah, they don't want you getting too greedy. Look. Trust issues. They still, all that I said, they, they're giving, but they don't want to be used. Ouch. <laughs> So based off of what you've shown this person and things that you've been up against and realizing that it wasn't your energy responding, uh, they're going to trust the process dishonest. They're going to put you through some tests that you will pass with flying colors. And it's not going to take this person long because they're intuitive, they're smart, they're quick thinking too. So, and it's like this person... You make them want to change their ways. And they're trying to understand why they're not finding the person that they're looking for. Look at the way that you carry yourself. And so this person is like, I got to let this hurt go so that I could receive what I'm asking for. So they're going to be surprised. Yep. Asking you shall receive. You're protected, or this person is protecting their feelings, so they might uh, act a little standoffish because it's like something that you do. They've been in that situation, so they might have flashbacks about something because they're getting attached to you, and they feel like what you feeding them is BS, so they're afraid. So I feel like this person has been watching you deal with this third party situation and how you so okay, so personally speaking, I was unaware of the situation because I was going on my healing journey, that's what I asked for. But the way that he helped me get through my journey was to use the third party situation to open up my eyes to what had been done to me. Because once you like you can't fix what you don't know is broken. So once you know what to fix, you know, and this person was assuming that you would do crazy stuff because that's the way that they think. But when they find out that you already know was T, it's like, you know. They're going to be sitting there looking stupid. Uh, 
um, they're saying that it, that you need to save money so that you could, uh, like, I don't know if this person communicates with you about something that, like, so basically you'll have money that's put away so that when you get approached by this person, you could go get yourself done up. So you can look presentable. <laughs> And they said they got a lot to say. She got a lot to say to you. Money. Insurance. A used car. A townhouse. Shopping. So, you could be getting... A new place and you could celebrate by getting yourself done up and going out or you know just getting your priorities in order break the ice so I feel like you could be going out doing something and somebody offers to pay for it for you and that could just be the way of them trying to grab your attention or something like that and then it says they thought what they was doing was hurting you, thought they did something, but what they did to you was similar to a situation. And who did this to you, it broke you. Not what they did, but it broke your heart. So these third party situations were probably manipulated by, because, so, okay, you can't disrespect the person that takes care of you. Or else, I don't know. You you know, I don't like God fearing all that stuff like that. Honor thy mother and thy father type stuff. So it's like, what they did, it broke your heart. So you were in a deep depression. But they thought what they did to you was what was affecting you. But I feel like when you mess with the child of God and all that stuff like that, that's when you get your karma 10 times worse. But they thought that it was you giving the karma to them like by you by you doing backfiring and all that stuff like that doing black magic or whatever what they were doing to you but you were just like you you dealt with the situation and you healed from it and you moved on you didn't retell it stop stop you didn't retaliate or nothing like that so when I get to it, I'm going to talk. Their task... Oh, damn. <laughs> Their task is too hard and why yours are so easy. Because y'all want y'all stuff so... Y'all want y'all stuff instant. And Divine Feminine, she... She she trusts the process. She, she does it by the rules. She don't take no shortcuts or take no deals with nobody to make sure that they get their stuff by tomorrow instead of waiting until next week. Like It, it takes time... Um. So now they're saying, trying to figure out ways to get out of their karma, and in order to do that, they need a reaction out of you or something. I don't know. Recovery. So what you recovery I don't know no emotional damage So I feel like one okay so I feel like you went through what you needed to go through and now all your struggles and worries and and um you know like your financial situation and stuff is is starting to change for the better and once you get to the destination that's when you will release all your emotions people want to see you release your emotions now but it's like you don't have the energy for that because you're focused on getting to where you need to go and 
So once you get there, then you're going to relieve your emotions. And then I think you'll have room to address the situation. Because at the time, you were already dealing with something. So you didn't have time to deal. Well, you no, know, like I said, I didn't know that what, you know, I was like, I don't know. They exposed the traumas that I need to heal. Go sit down. Close your mouth and go sit down. So the third party situation only opened up my eyes to the trauma that I needed to heal from. And uh, the person who caused the trauma wanted to use the third party to see what type of reaction I would have gave if like some old childish stuff I don't know but also the person that calls trauma on divine feminine is receiving their karma and they're afraid of how lenient the karma is gonna be because they know that um they no longer have that hold over divine feminine to the point where if feeling like dang you took it to that point I'm gonna take it to that point but it's not even that it's what you already did to divine feminine is being returned to you 10 times worse because it was on purpose it wasn't to in, in, um, improve the situation it was to make the situation worse when there's a bigger I don't know a bigger goal in life than your own personal gain I don't know how to say it but so this person used the third party situation to try to make it seem like divine feminine had that energy towards them because they actually did it but it's only because they thought that they were going to receive what this person received for doing what they did to divine feminine so but really It only opened up divine feminine eyes to what was happening because this this person receiving their karma for first attacking divine feminine and trying to get this third party to attack divine feminine to okay so like they say it's numbers against one because it was one it was one versus one so this person felt like if they got the third party to attack divine feminine that divine feminine would give up and they wouldn't have to deal with the karma of how they raised divine feminine over the years and the things that they did knowing that they could have done differently so 